What is really good, YouTube? It's your boy Shaka252. Give me one second. Oh, today's video, man, just checking in because I got a notification in my email that if I didn't keep making videos, they were gonna cut off my monetization. I work, but anyway, figure I'll make a video. Give you guys an update what I got going on with the with the Super B. And you probably already saw right there on the wide body Durango, one of my flares came off a while back. Even when I, after I dropped that reveal video, um, one of the flares came off two days after I got it back from the shop. Uh, Vicra sent me another part, a replacement part. Um, it's getting painted right now. And I'm, I believe tomorrow, which will be Monday, I'm gonna drop it off at that shop. They're gonna lock it in place for real this time. And after that, uh, we'll be back in business. But as far as the Super B, oh yeah, let me start with the hood. Let me pop the hood for you guys. The first edition. Oh man, I was looking for this. First edition. Um, shouts out to Fasty's Garage, man, out in Texas. Um, Fasty's Garage. Um, he decided to make custom uh, plates for all the Super Bs. And I told him I wanted number 252, and you already know why. But yeah, he hooked me up with this, man. Uh, pretty dope. And this. This little piece right here came from the, the infamous Grocery Getter Racing, man. You guys know on the old Charger, I, I definitely had plenty of things from him. And um, he got me all hooked up with this. I think it turned out pretty good. I was on the fence about making it white. Uh, but I think it turned out pretty good because of the white pops along with that, of course. But I think that turned out pretty good. Let me know what you guys think in the, in the comments. I'll show you a clip now of some of the little things I got for the charger. I'll show you now. That stuff I got right there, um, that's what's going in the car. I bought the subs, subwoofer, um, I got the amp, some little accessories, a little bit of lights. I'm not gonna go crazy on the lights like I did last time. Um, but I think it's gonna look good, man. Um, I had got a custom box made. Well, actually they make custom boxes for the charger. And got a custom box right here. They make it specifically for the Dodge Charger. My 12s are gonna go in there. My SCAR 12s going inside there. Um, as you can see, I already changed out the lights. I swapped out the lights, uh, the puddle lights, they're purple. Um, but yeah, <clears throat> I got a shop that I'm working with. Um, they're gonna do this build. It's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be super clean. Um, and I'm gonna do some things that I always wanted to do in the old charger, but I couldn't do it, if that makes sense. Um, the shop I'm using is a shop called Carolina Stance in Greenville, South Carolina. Um, they're going to be the ones that I'm using. Don't give me a hard time about my garage. Uh, look, I cleaned this thing up and then it still went crazy. But anyway, anyway, houses in NC do not have storage. So they give you really, there's really, really nice houses available, but storage is a, is a no-go. Another thing I'm I'm adding to the car, uh, as you can see here, got a carbon fiber front splitter that I'm adding on to the car for the wide body. Um, and you see these boxes right here. See what that is? Those are my compressors. So I got my air ride. So I actually ordered. I ordered my air ride. 
I ordered my air ride the same day that I bought the car. And I ordered my wheels also. So my wheels are on the way. I'm trying to think what else I got. I got so much stuff in here. This rear carbon fiber uh, diffuser does not fit. It does not fit the wide body. It fits the narrow body. I sold that to my cousin. Um, he's he's in uh, Kuwait right now. But right here, I'm not gonna pull it out. I got a carbon fiber spoiler to replace that one on the rear. Um, what else I got? Oh yeah, so if you watch my video right now and you own a Dodge Durango, hit me up because I have an extra wide body kit. I got an extra wide body kit for a Durango, for a Dodge Durango. So if you got a Dodge Durango, um, hit me up on IG, Shaka252 or 392 underscore Megatron, and we'll work out a deal. I'll send it out to you. And also, I got stock wheels for Durango. So if you want the stock Hellcat wheels from, from a, a Hellcat Durango, hit me up. I got these two. You got these P0 freaking freaking scorpion. I want these, holla at me. But yeah, guys, I was just making a quick video, giving you guys an update on, on what I had going on. Um, because uh, YouTube was like, hey, we're gonna pull your monetization if you don't make another video. So, but it's been a minute since I dropped a video, but that's pretty much it. That's, that's all I got, guys. Uh, dropping the car off this week. I'm actually, uh, I gotta get somebody to follow me down to Greenville, South Carolina. I'm gonna drop this off. The guy's gonna have it about a week, week and a half. And yeah, when it comes back, it's gonna it's gonna be a little bit different. And then I got my, got my Hellcat Durango out there. Hopefully this week, hopefully this week, I'll have that flare put back on because I have not been presenting that thing. It's not a good presentation. Um, but yeah, that's that's all I got. If you haven't already, like, comment, subscribe. In the comments, let me know what you think about the strut bar that I got. Um, and give me some guesses on what you think the, the wheels. Let me know what color wheels you think I, I order. So uh, I won't say color. What kind of wheels? What brand? Oh, you probably know the brand, but let me know what you think my wheels will look like. How about that? Um, I've been thinking about doing a giveaway soon. So maybe whoever, whoever in the comments, let's do that. Whoever gets... Whoever gets it right in the comments, if you know, if you come as close as possible to the kind of wheels, color wheels, type of wheels, brand of wheels, if you put that in the comments and and you're, and you're almost there or you guess it straight up, which I think you won't guess it straight up, I, I'm gonna send you something. I'll have something for you. So yeah, putting out that challenge, man. Let me know in the comments what you think kind of wheels, color the wheels, style of the wheels that you think I'm gonna get for, for the Super V. But that's all I got, guys. Uh, I'll catch you on the next one. I'm gonna drop some. As soon as I get the Durango squared away, I'm gonna drop footage for, for, uh, for the Durango. All right, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. All right, peace.